If you're a recovered COVID-19 patient, it's likely there are antibodies in the plasma in your blood. By donating your convalescent plasma, you could help up to three patients who are still fighting off the virus. The process is easy. We've got to have a medically confirmed COVID-19 test. Ben Williamson, the communications director for the American Red Cross for South Carolina, says once you're 14 days symptom free of the coronavirus, feeling well and you're eligible to donate, you should contact the Red Cross. And then someone will reach out to you and hopefully schedule an appointment. This will happen at one of the two low country blood donation centers, either in Mount Pleasant or West Ashley. Once you arrive, you'll fill out paperwork and then nurses will hook you up to the machine and take your plasma while you relax. This is proven now to be a, a uh, effective uh, treatment slash aid to those that are really have serious cases of the coronavirus. The FDA issued an emergency use authorization for convalescent plasma as a treatment to COVID-19 patients over the weekend. The issue right now is that we're putting convalescent plasma out, sending it out, distributing it much more quickly than we are bringing it in. Williamson says in the last month, the Red Cross has seen a need from hospitals not just here in South Carolina, but across the country double in requests for convalescent plasma. But donating with the Red Cross means the organization will work to meet the need locally first with the ability to send it nationwide if necessary. We've been able to collect a convalescent plasma from about 14,000 donors from across the country and have been able to distribute about 32,000 units of convalescent plasma. At the end of the day, you could be helping someone in need. When you're giving convalescent plasma, think about the person that will soon get that. Olivia Parsons, count on two.